Okay, film the rest. Right, right. There you go. All right, sit up nice and comfortable for me. Put your butt way back. To press that clutch pedal to the floor. No problem. Too well, right? Okay, we're going to plug the in here. Hang on a minute. There we go. All right, can you hear me okay? I can hear you good. All right, very good. Can you tell me your name and where you're from? My name is Bobby. I'm from Orlando. All right, Bobby. Welcome to Daytona. My name's Jay. I'll be your instructor today. Nice to meet you, Jay. Bobby, you doing a rookie or King's experience? Um, Eight laps or, or 16? 16, I believe. Okay, very good. All right, that's uh, Danny buckling you in. As soon as we're done buckling you in, Danny's going to put the steering wheel on the column in front of you, and I need you to give it a good tug back towards you to make sure it's on securely, okay? Gotcha. All right, Bobby, any racing experience? No, sir. All right, well, you're going to have it in a few minutes. All right. All right. Cover this release right here for emergencies only. That'll get you out of your harness. Okay. All right. Okay, here comes a wheel. Put that wheel on. Give it a good pull towards you. Very good. We're not going anywhere. No, nope. a couple things to talk about before we head out. The first is going to be the driving line here at Daytona. It's going to be right in the middle of the track. I'll give this guy a thumbs up for your picture. All right, the driving line is going to be right in the middle of the track all the way around. You see the white lines out there? Yep. We want to stay just to the left or just below those white lines all the way around. You won't see them everywhere, but I'll show you where you need to be. Gotcha. And the second is a progressive approach. I'm going to start you off slow. You've got 16 laps coming to you. I don't want you to look for any, any speed records of first eight. We're going to work on the driving line, the, the, the bank turns, the handling of the car, and then I'll progressively try and pick you up from there, okay? okay. Mm -hmm. Now, you good with four speed? Yep. Okay. Now, once we get started, I'm going to start the car from over here. You're going to need to pump the gas a little bit. Then hold about 2,000 RPM on the tachometer with the gas. Okay. All right? And first gear is going to be all the way over, straight up. Reverse is locked out. The green light will come on when you're in first gear. Okay. Once we go down pit road and we're moving, we're going to go at a nominal rate. Uh, but enough of a rate so that we can get into third gear by the time we hit the Sunoco sign at the end of pit road. All right. Just beyond that is where we'll blend up on the pit road, and I'll show you when and how to do that because it could be other cars up there. Uh, after that, we'll hit fourth gear and start your run. Cool. Okay. Right, great. Now I want you to continue to think about looking as far forward as you can everywhere around the track. Don't look in front of the, the car. Look where you want to go. Don't look at the wall or the yellow lines. I want you to looking at the middle of the track, especially through the turns. You're always going to go where you look. Okay. If you're having to do this, then you're not looking far forward enough because you're having to make little corrections. Okay. Or you're looking at the wall, then you're looking at the yellow line. Right in the middle of the track is what I want you to concentrate right, on. Jay. Okay? Cool. All right. Because every time, at, at a super speedway like this, really anywhere, any time you move the wheel, you're scrubbing speed off the car. You're taking speed away. And the way these cars are geared at super speedways, it takes them a little bit of time to get up to speed. So if you start moving that wheel, it's going to take the car time after you stop to recover and get back up to speed. You may not feel it, but you'll definitely see it in lap times. Okay. All right. Any questions? Uh, can I run through the gears real fast? Sure, go ahead. Push that clutch in. Uh, all the way over, that's first. Straight back is second. Up and over is third. And straight back is fourth. Now you can feel the gear shifter. Don't be bashful with it. It's not a little Toyota. It's an old school four-speed transmission. Just yank that thing into gear. Okay. All right? Yeah, you I won't drive, break it. I drive a little Mini Cooper, so... Oh, yeah. I no, you got to drive this thing kind of like you hate it. Okay, right on. Yep. So are you with this uh, Dell company? Yes, sir. All right, very good. And you're from Orlando? Yes, sir. All right, very good. Checkers one. Very good. Yeah, originally from Texas, but... Oh, okay. But uh, I thought I heard a little accent there. Yeah. Yep. Well, West Texas, it doesn't really exist. 39. I just said All right. I'm actually going out to Dallas next week uh, to do our uh, instruct on our exotic cars with our exotic car program. Oh, that's got to be fun. Yeah, they can be a little intense. Those cars got a lot of grip, and you're back and forth like this constantly. It can be a little, uh, when I first learned how to do it, got, I got a little motion sickness. <laughs> <laughs> but you get used to it. Yeah, definitely get used to it. These cars are a lot more stable. Oh, yeah. Now, when you go into the turns, no matter how fast you go, you are not going to have to slow down. Because okay. they'll just squat and stick right to the track. The tires, the speed and the airflow over the car all act to just suck the car right down to the track. Gotcha. Fire the next group. All right, let's
Let's get you started, Bob. Give me a little bit of gas. 2,000 RPM. And first gear, please. And hold us here. Now that yellow car is going to take off first, and then we'll follow them out. Okay. Roll the next room straight out. All right, follow them out. Keep that gas up. Keep that gas up. Give it some gas. Oh, my bad. That was my one thing I was worried about. Give it some gas. All right, let that clutch out. All right. Straight out, tough enough. All right, a little bit more gas. Give it a second in third gear. All right, keep giving us some speed. A little more speed. Blend us up onto the track, please. All the way up there, keep going, more speed, fourth gear. All right, keep giving us some speed and get us right next to the white lines, more speed. Now you're not gonna have to turn much, the car will turn itself at this speed, but keep us up there. Very good. Now when we come off the turn, now keep us in the middle of the track, we don't wanna go near that yellow line, however, when we come off the turn, I want you to get right next to the yellow line. We're going to have another car come by us. So just stay right next to the yellow line. Come off that gas a little bit. All right, right back up in line, Bobby, right where that car is. That's where we want to be on the back stretch here. Keep going. And you're going to have to hold us up there. Because the car wants to turn left. Go so right next to the white lines. And keep us up there. More speed. There you go. And hold us up there. Good. Uh, Very right. good. Very good. And put us right in the middle of the short shoot here. Good. You can give it a little more speed if you'd like. If you're comfortable, you can stay where you're at. All right. It's up to you. I'm getting there. All right. Now remember, we want to enter the turn right by the white lines. Stay on the gas. We need the speed through the turns. There you go. Keep us right in the middle. This is a perfect spot right here. All right. You can use that seam in the pavement almost as a guide. Okay. A little more left. And bring us to the middle of the track. Gonna have to come to the right a little bit, a little bit. Hold us here, good. Alright, All right, stay in that gas, stay in that gas, stay in it, it'll stick. There you go. Doing a great job, Bob, uh, nice and go. smooth. Now, when we come off this turn, same thing again, we're gonna get right next to the yellow line. Just burp that gas a little bit, let that other car pass us. So right next to the yellow line. Just come off the gas just a tad. All right, back on the gas. And right back up in line, Bob. Good. Keep us in the middle. There you go, Luke. Keep, yeah, hold us up, there you go. You gotta hold us up there, because the car wants to Stay in that gas, stay in it. There you go. Keep us in the middle. Keep us in the middle. There you go. The middle back here is going to feel a little right of center, okay? Yeah. But this is right where we need to be. That seam in the pavement should be coming right through the middle of the car. Right next to those white lines. Stay in it. Stay in it. There you go. Keep this in the middle.
unit, the car will stick. Just look as far through that turn as you can. Look where you want to go. Look at the track, right in the middle of the track. Very good. It'll stick, stay in it, stay in it. Just look as far through that turn as you can. There you go, Bob. There you go, you're doing it. There we go. Excellent. Keep this in the middle. There you go, line this up there. A little bit more, perfect, hold this here. Yep, keep us out of that grass. 
little more brake, no gas, a little more brake. All right, just come off the brake, let the car coast. No gas, no clutch, no brake. How was that, Bob? That was good. You did a great job, my friend. Now we're going to go in, get you some something to drink. All right. Talk about a few things, and we'll get after your second set of laps, all right? Awesome. All right. Yeah, that's intense. Yeah, you had a good progression up through your laps. We're going to progress like that again, but I feel that this next set of laps will be a little quicker for you. Okay, good. Because now you know what to expect and where to expect it. Right. And like I said, that line of sight thing, looking where you want to go, it's crucial here. Oh, it, it really is. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. All right, a little tap of the brakes just to make sure we got pressure. Good. And keep us moving. We want to stay right in between the white and yellow lines, please. Gotcha. A little bit of gas just to keep us moving. All right, and you can slip the car into neutral now. And just let it coast from here. And what we're going to do, we're going to go right down pit road to the right side. More brake, please. More brake. And we're going to stop right where that gentleman is motioning you. A little, little, little more brake. We want to come in nice and easy. He's going to have a cup of water there for you. Take your time with it. We're in no hurry. Cool. Perfect. Right here is good. Thank you. 